In the jungles of Papua New Guinea, North Queensland, Australia, it's mating season. And two male green tree pythons silently engage. A female has lured them close with her powerful pheromones. Despite being cold-blooded animals, in matters of love, snakes are very passionate. The king cobra, native to the Indian subcontinent and South and East Asia, is the world's largest venomous snake. It can measure up to five meters with a bite to match its size. Two good reasons for being very careful when it comes to disputes over potential lovers. During the mating season, it's common for males to compete for the favors of a female. But in order to avoid the unnecessary death of male challengers, king cobras in fact carry out ritualized display combats. The adversaries push and entwine each other, competing to see who can gain the higher position and by extension, the higher status. Ritual skirmishes like this may last for hours, with only the shrewdest and strongest coming out on top, literally and figuratively. The male must leave the battlefield and slink back to the refuge of the jungle. All over the planet, snakes display similar mating behavior. This is the case in Mexico with grey-banded king snakes. But before pairing up to mate, this king snake urgently needs a supply of energy. The tongue plays a fundamental role in the life of many ophidians, the reptile group that snakes belong to. It performs functions far beyond merely the sense of taste. Like other reptiles, snakes use it to hunt. Smell particles in the air guide them both to their prey and females in heat. Just a few scent molecules floating in the air are enough for them to discover their prey. Hunger now sated, it's time to think about other pressing matters. The process of mating in snakes is complex, delicate, and time consuming. Pairs engage in a game consisting of biting, rubbing, and tying each other in knots. The choreographed foreplay ends when the male kingsnake grips the female on the neck while he positions himself on top. 
This is the immediate prelude to copulation.